Hi Nick. So, I told you I would give you a tour of this house since you hadn't seen it before. Sorry that it's a mess and sorry that I look like shit. So, anyway, here we go. This is the living room. I guess I should have turned on some lights first. Okay. This is my living room. This part I'm actually staying in used to be the uh, garage. So that means that this was the entrance. So this part was the garage and they, you know, obviously turned it into what it is now. And then this part was some smaller entryway, I guess. A big fireplace. Like I said, it's a mess. I'm sorry. So here we have the master bedroom that was also added on later. It's also a mess. So this is where David and I did sleep. Now David just sleeps here. There's all my clothes when I'm trying to get ready to move. And bathroom. With panties, but those are actually mine. And Miss Belle. There's Miss Belle. She's so cute. There's Mr. Bobo. Here, there's the backyard where I let the doggies out. And the laundry room. Um, here's the dining room and the kitchen. Here is the smaller living room, which I would turn on some lights in here. I guess I can come in here and do that. There's an overhead light in here. There's only one little light over there. Here's Bobo. Say hi, Bobo. Bobo. Front door, front yard. Really not much to here. This was the only room I really got kind of decorated the way I wanted to. So. Let the doggies play. And here's my kitchen. Well, it used to be my kitchen. Lots and lots of wood as was the style in the 50s. My old ass oven. This still works. And hallway. Here's the messy room that I was sleeping in. So there's my messy room. I know you're cringing. computer room where I used to sit and talk to you. So this is where David spends all his time playing video games. As you can tell, everything about my house is messy. Um, just another guest room. Really not much to see other than more mess and boxes for me to pack. Some stuff I already have packed. Come on puppies. Out. And the bathroom. This was actually the first thing I tackled. It had got off a wallpaper in it and I painted it red. I really love that shower curtain. If I could take it with me, I would. But alas, I have no shower to put it in. So this was my first project. I think I did a pretty good job giving it up. sink and everything. Anyway, it's not much to show. Not much to tell. Anyway, so there's the house I formerly lived in and now you've seen it since you can't see it in real life. Anyway, I love you. Bye.